this is what we're going to... All right, hi guys, this is DJ Anita, and I am here with Rune Tune, also known as Rita, but for the interview, we are going to call her Rita, um, as she has asked, so hello. That's where you talk. <laughs> <laughs> So she's here with Hi. Okay, okay. She's nervous, so don't mind her. Um, so we are going to start with questions since you're all nervous and stuff, just to break the ice a little bit. Uh, yeah. One of our users, our members, users, uh, asked, where do you come up with ideas for your videos? Um, well, the ideas were obviously from the game, and I watch a lot of um, cartoons and, you know, all this loony... Looney Tunes and, and I don't know, I just <laughs> I just come up with sh- you know crazy shit. So yeah, <laughs> I like Looney Tunes. <laughs> Looney Tunes is amazing. What about anime? Oh, yes. Animes have anything um, to do? Yeah, with- Pokemon. I watch a lot of Pokemon, Dragon Ball Z. Um, I don't watch Naruto. Um, well, what else do I watch? Yeah, Dragon Ball Z mostly and um, Pokemon. <laughs> That's what we're, I get my um, drawing styles, like my drawing style. So uh-huh. it's com- kind of similar to um, Dragon Ball Z a little bit, but mm-hmm. more of a loony way. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, I had posted because somebody else was going to do this for us, but uh, I am now today. So I had posted, how long does it usually take you to make and edit these videos? Uh, pretty damn long. Um, some of my videos, um, well... How, how do I put this? Um, my armadillo video, that armadillo trip, took me at least um, over 50 hours of work. Mm-hmm. So roughly I spent around two weeks on that, planning it and everything. And, yeah, so my recent one took me about two months of work, the pecan one. Uh, I don't know if you guys, if you if you have watched it or not, the... Um, the Y Bank mm-hmm. animation. Did you watch that one? I haven't. I'm gonna be honest, but I did watch the Armadillo one with um. Yeah. Uh, what was his name? I can't remember. Yeah. Well, the recent one um took me over ninety hours of work. So yeah, they take me pretty damn long to make. So yeah. Didn't that one that one drawing that you showed me with that like. 50 million people in it. Well, not 50 million, but... <laughs> 50 million, yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> like, a lot of people in it um, take you, like, 400 uh, hours? Yeah, over, over 200 people, well, over 200 characters, including, you know, the NPC bosses and all this other shit. Um, that took me four months and a half to plan. And um, it took me, yeah, 400 hours of work. Yeah, you know, just to plan everything. Okay, but it was awesome. Um, all the characters, yeah, it's um, just... It's hard. I will get a link to that as well, and yeah. we'll put it in the thing so you guys can see what we were talking about. Yeah. Um, that video was amazing, and the things that she did in it was just yeah. And I did that in my free time. I mean, I did it with no cost and everything. It was just like my it's a hobby, you know. Mm-hmm. Like when I come back from work or school, and um, yeah, I just you know did it on my spare time. So yeah, I had a lot of free time. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Free time's good, and yeah, it's it putting good use to it. And and with that, you're you're showing the world. You're like, oh yeah. I mean, if you and... yeah, if you enjoy what you you know love doing, so mm-hmm. it's worth it. I like DJing, so I do it. <laughs> oh, yeah. uh, I'll hire you for my next birthday DJ and my next birthday party. Oh yay! Are you gonna pay for me to come to Australia? Like I said, you can swim. <laughs> it's gonna be a one long swim. <laughs> It'll take me. Uh, let me start yesterday, <laughs> and I'll get there soon. <laughs> uh oh, I think I lost you. I'm here. I'm here. Oh, good. Okay. Uh, <laughs> do you plan on making? Or can, do you plan on continuing to make these videos, or moving um, on to other things such as RSMVs or commentary videos? Oh, no, I am not good with commentary videos and stuff like that. I, I, I pretty much suck at that. Um, no, I just keep on doing what I um, do, to be honest. Animation and drawing videos, this, this is what I do. I don't so, think you uh, suck at commentary videos. I've watched <laughs> a few of your how-to-do-things videos. Uh, um, 
I wasn't really that. Yeah, it was sh- shitty. <laughs> that is also her favorite word. <laughs> I'm just going to warn you now, you're going to hear it quite often. <laughs> yeah. Uh, when did you start playing RuneScape? Well, I started around, well, 04. Mm-hmm. But um, I had an account. I made an account and I just stopped playing for a couple months. After that, um, I came back in 06. So I made another account because I could not remember, you know, my like password and username. So I made a new one. And, um, yeah, I started 06 January with this account, um, Kplicker, yeah. And uh, do you know what your, like, total level is or your first 99? I don't like I remember my total level, but I'm all 99s and 106 Dungeoneering. That's hot. You need to get that to 120. Uh Nah, man, I, I, I stopped playing. Well, I stopped becoming inactive in 2010, so, yeah. Oh, well, we'll get you there. One day, <laughs> maybe. One day. Uh, you know? So, uh, can you tell us what program you use to make your animation videos? <laughs> um, I get this question a lot. I mean, okay, I use Microsoft Word and Paint. No, I'm joking. Um, <laughs> I use um, Adobe Flash for um, animation, and I use um, Adobe Photoshop for my still backgrounds, you know, the backgrounds on the animation. So that's why I do my um, paintings and stuff for the backgrounds. And, um, yeah, and just Adobe Flash for animation, like frame to frame, the characters and stuff, and... After that, I put them all on Sony Vegas, and if I need to do some effects and stuff, I just use Sony Vegas for that. I suck at Vegas. <laughs> I do. Like, I can't I can't ever, like, I can't seem to, like, match up things, and, like, I, I, don't, just, I don't understand framing and stuff. I understand a little bit more watching yours. Just watch a lot of tutorials, yours, trust me. Tutorials I, I, will help you out. It's, it's I'm pretty good. I'm going to start doing that, because yeah. I absolutely suck, and I have, like... that's, this, yeah... That's how you learn, because that's how I learned from, um, that's how I taught myself, you know, um, from tutorials, from, you know, online and some websites you can go visit mm. for um, Adobe Flash, well, not Flash, but um, Photoshop and um, pretty, Sony Vegas, yes. Yeah. Pretty good at vi- uh, Photoshop. I actually make some um, signatures for our members yeah. of the site, so done pretty I well mean, with that. K- keep using Photoshop and you'll get better at it, to be honest. Actually, you I have. Improving. I was amazed. Yeah. <laughs> I was slightly <laughs> amazed on what I've been able yeah. to do. So, um, one of our members, uh, he's actually one of our content team members. He says, ooh, I love Rita's videos. Yeah. Uh, so nice to see you're getting an interview. Uh, he couldn't think of any questions. Glad you like my videos. He likes them. Um, Glad you enjoy them. Do you remember what your first 99 was? Oh, boy. Um... Hang on. <laughs> Flashback. Um, <laughs> strength was my first non-non combat. Yay. And then my first non-combat was runecrafting. Yeah. Because um, back in the days, runecrafting was good money. Where you made, you know, nets and shit. <laughs> okay. It's nets. amazing how you got uh, runecrafting first. Because most people save that for last. Yeah. I was... I think I remember, I still have a picture, I think I was ranked something 200 and something when I was 99 room crafting. Yeah. Wow. When I got um, 99, yeah, it was ages ago, yeah. I gave you props on getting 99 room <laughs> first. I hear people yes. talking about it now and I'm just like, ugh. You know, oh. well, now they have rune span, so rune span. Rune span, I, I can't, that's funny. Uh, <laughs> it's like, it's not rune crafting anymore. It's rune spam. <laughs> yeah, it's it's okay. I rune spam mine. I got ninety one rune crafting out of it, so I'm not mad that's, at all. So it makes it easier. That's cool. <laughs> uh, <laughs> how long did it take you to master the, like this style of video making? Because I know most people do like um, the RSMVs and stuff. I don't know. I well, I don't know how to explain this. Um, I, I started using flash in august right but before i um, started animating i was just making videos like drawing videos and stuff and um editing my videos like you know 
how I do speed paintings and speed drawings, and I was just editing them. And I used Photoshop. Uh, what do you get? What do you, what do you say? Photoshop mm-hmm. a lot. Like I've been using it for three years, and when I started on Adobe Flash, it kind of was easy to learn the basics because I already knew a lot about um, Photoshop, and it was kind of you know mm-hmm. quick to learn from for. Uh, blah, what the fuck am I saying? Um, <laughs> sorry. Yeah, it was kind of easy for me to learn Flash. So, um, but uh, as a kid, I um, used to, you know, how you you have this little flip book, and um, you used to, I uh, I used to draw on, like I used to animate on paper. And, and then I'm just make it go flip. through the pages, yeah. flip through the pages, and make yeah, it make it move. The fa- yeah, make it move. That's what I used to do, you know, when I was a kid. So I wish I would have been able to do that. I was never <laughs> the drawer. I was more like the singer, yeah. and you know, the to do with my actual like stuff. Yeah. So, um, my brother was more of the put together stuff, um, yeah. like Legos and whatnot. And so, like, neither one of us had like the draw. Well, he draws now, but it's not like not like you, not nothing like you well, do. I mean, if you just keep drawing, keep drawing, you just improve more, you know. Because you I, I stopped, I stopped drawing for a couple of years, um, and I got really bad. And then I was like, you know, got back to it, and then I kept, I started to improve again. So you just gotta keep drawing every day. Like, you know, five minutes is alright every day, just as long as you draw, you know, mm-hmm. and you improve. It's just. Got to f- keep focused, you know? <laughs> Focus for me is harder. I get so busy with everything else. I'm just like, yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's hard to like, just and drawing, it would probably bore the crap out of me personally. But <laughs> watching you, like I can sit and watch a whole one of your videos <laughs> and, and, and be so intrigued by what you do and how you do it. And yeah, um, just like, oh, I wish I could do that, you know, because it's, it's amazing. Um. So, Thanks. I love them. Yay. <laughs> um, what are your hobbies? My hobbies? Mm-hmm. I don't know, drawing. <laughs> outside, okay, so outside of drawing, <laughs> what do you, what do you <laughs> like to do? <laughs> do you like, knit, um, like, some people knit, some people swim, uh, ride bikes. Um, what do I have? What hobbies do I have? Uh... Well, I go to the gym. Does that count? Yep. <laughs> um, I walk the dog. Does that count? Yeah. That's, that's all I do. <laughs> and I come well, home and I do. <laughs> yeah. Then I go to work and then that's it. Yeah. That's all I do. I swear. That's amazing. <laughs> no, no, a walking dog is good because you're spending time with them. Yeah, uh, I love her. dogs. Eh, him or her, I don't know what it is, but um, yeah, she, <laughs> she, she, okay, she, 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 my, <laughs> um, so um, no, those are great. It, it's good exercise too, walking your dog. Yeah, because so. you know, as an animator, you need to. I sit, you know, I sit like bloody eight hours a day, or sometimes six or five. You know, I need to move around, mm-hmm. so exercising is good. Keep me active. You know, my body active and shit. <laughs> Keep that blood flowing, right? Yeah, that's right. All right. One of our users named A Random Dicer has asked, how did you get the name Cape Licker? <laughs> that's a long, long story. Um, Well, my real name wasn't actually Cape Licker. I was lean back. But, you know, when the change name came out, mm-hmm. yeah, that's, that's when, when I actually, because um, I used to go around people and tell, I used to troll them and I'm like, can I lick your cape because it's so awesome and stuff. And then people used to be like, you're so rude and shit. And I was like, sweet, I'm a rude person. So um, <laughs> I, one day I just <laughs> logged out and changed my name and Aren't just to piss off the people. Uh, yeah, I was, I'm a player mod. <laughs> Yeah, I get that a lot. I'm sure a player mod. How the hell are you a player mod? Um, I don't know. It's just, it's just be yourself, to be honest. And 
that's that's amazing that you have cape liquor oh, as a name and in, in your player mod. That's hot. Yeah. I once got a um, PM from a player mod like, your name kind of is kind of inappropriate, and I replied to him, yeah, and he's like, wow, you're a mod. I'm like, yeah, and that's amazing. <laughs> Yeah, hey, I don't a... think it's amazing. I don't think it's offensive. I love your name, actually. Um, it it's... just shows your personality and your own name, uh, and the <laughs> fact that you. It take brings it to a heart. lot of memories to, um, like, I was just a troll, you know. I just need to troll people, and I need to make fun of them. I need to make fun of people. It's just like I didn't really mean it. It's just like for fun I did it. Mm-hmm. But people need to get pissed off, and um, they need to be so mad at me, and it was so funny. I loved it. <laughs> that's hot. <laughs> so good. <laughs> so you used to so troll. Yeah, that's it. how I got mad. So guys, you can troll as long as you're friendly about it, and you can still possibly be a player mod one day. So don't get your hopes up. <laughs> or wait, wait, wrong way wording. Wait, way wrong wording. So keep them hopes up. <laughs> and he also asked, uh, how often do you visit Rune Zone? Well, I started. A couple months ago, mm-hmm. like I just come listen to you know room radio because, like, when I'm drawing, I need to listen to something so I don't get bored. So I just come down and you know, once in a while, yeah. probably like. Have you registered yet? I did, but um, I haven't got a ver- you know how you get an email verification thing, mm-hmm. and I haven't got that yet, <laughs> so I'm Holy still waiting. God. Uh, I'll definitely look into that for you. Um, on a scale of one rainbow dash to ten rainbow dash, uh, how much do you like MLP? Wait, wait, what? <laughs> on a scale of one rainbow dash to ten rainbow dash, basically a scale of one to Isn't ten. Isn't rainbow dash that pony? I'm assuming. How much do you like My Little Pony? <laughs> I don't wait. I don't watch that shit. <laughs> <laughs> so obviously one rainbow dash. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but I have I have I have some requests. People telling me to draw um their character as a pony. So yeah, you might have. I give it a two rainbow dash. Okay. But how about that? <laughs> a two rainbow dash is better than a one, I guess. Yeah. Um, and he wants to know will you draw him? And who's this? Uh, a ram a random dicer. He's our community supervisor, social media guru. Okay. Do you, I can draw him as a pony character if he wants, you know, dicing. <laughs> oh, that'll be hot. I think he'll love that. Uh, he yeah. will love that. If I can talk, it would be great. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, let's see. Uh, the last one we had on site was uh, is it hard to make the videos and what can we expect in the future? In the it's future? Rock, yeah. You expect more videos from me? Like, I will be making a RuneScape, a Rune 2 music video, not a RuneScape. Well, it is RuneScape, but yeah, a Rune 2 music video. And yes, they are hard to make, because there is still a lot of things I need to learn. Um, and yeah, I'll keep making videos, and you guys will keep, you know, watching me improve and stuff. So yeah, I won't stop, because this is what I love doing. And I love making I entertaining people and... um. That's all that matters, so yeah. Alright, so what other games do you play besides RuneScape? <laughs> I used to play Skyrim. Um, I stopped. And now I just bought Diablo 3 yesterday and I want to stop, but it's hard. <laughs> because it's keeping me away from making my videos, so... Yeah, I seen yeah. that on Twitter. You were all, uh, what did you say? It, like, I'll even word it word for word. Uh, gotta stop <laughs> playing Diablo, or else I'll never get videos done. <laughs> yeah, I. Yeah, it's just hard to get off once you're on, you know. I yeah. I, I, I just don't play platform games though. Yeah. I, can, I play RuneScape. That's the only game I play. I'm boring. Yeah. Well, when I was playing RuneScape. I was just playing RuneScape back then, but when I became inactive, so I just started playing all these random games, so, yeah. But back in, you know, I was always focused on getting max level, you know, maxed out, so I kind of maxed out, like, all 99s before Dungeoneering came out, like, it was in 09, mm-hmm. 
mm-hmm. like in I think it was in June or something. So that's when I maxed out everything. So yeah. So now that I'm not, you know. Oh, so you had to draw your ninety nines basically the hard way. Kind of yeah. Click a bow and then click a bowstring. Click a bow. Click a bowstring. Repeat. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fletching was the shittest. It's easy now, I, even though I don't have ninety nine <laughs> yet. <laughs> Go fight me, right? Bloody hell, Slayer! <laughs> you can AFK Slayer now too. <laughs> no, no, Slayer is uh, cool. still the same way. Uh, it was before. Yeah. They haven't really done much to it, unless you do Squeal of Fortune or not Squeal of Fortune. Yeah, you can do Squeal of Fortune. <laughs> Squeal of Fortune. <laughs> Wait, what are your thoughts on that, by the way? What is your? Oh, uh, you can watch my video and you'll know what my thought. Yeah, I made, I made a video on that too. Uh, I don't. I don't. Um, I don't mind the steel. Um, uh, not steel. Um. Is it still Squeal of Fortune? I was like, Steal Your Fortune. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. I call it Squeal of Stolen. So. A, squ- <laughs> a Squeal of Crap, Steal Your Fortune, all this crap. I don't know. Yeah. But yeah, I, I, I don't mind the, um, you know, how they need to give three spins every day, two spins, or one spin. I don't know how, much, how many it was. One but non- since the buy um, spins thing came out, I was just not happy with that. I just was like, nah, man, this is ridiculous. I mean, it's just off. <laughs> I just do my free spins and call it good. And I, I they didn't give uh, the people that have uh, the yeah. quest cape all the spins that anybody who, like, starts now can get, like, a million spins, I swear, uh, or, like, uh, 300 yeah. something spins free because they get spins for doing, they get two spins for doing a quest, and I was like, oh, oh. I already have my quest cape, that's not fair. <laughs> so, you, so what, now the people do quests, and they get free spins now? Yeah, so they're promoting oh. people to do quests, which is a good thing, because uh, quests yeah. open up more of the games and um, stuff, but... i got 20 quests I haven't completed, so, yeah. Yeah, you can go get 40 squills. Bullshit, I ain't gonna come. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, they just came out with another one, so it's now 20... 21 quests. Oh, and the sweet. new quest is good. I actually did the new quest. So, it was um, amazing. I yeah. loved it. It was a good storyline. It was good. I loved it too. I did it last week, so it was alright. I just did it because I needed some ideas for my next video. So yeah. Did it help you with ideas? Oh, yeah. It helped me a lot. But, you know. <laughs> if you could create a new skill in RuneScape, in RuneScape um, what would it be? Huh. Drawing. Really? <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't know. Um, what skill? Like I've always sat and thought about what how what skill we could do, and I I, I seriously can't come up with another one. Um. <sighs> what skill? Um, I don't know. I don't know to be honest. <laughs> Neither. It got everything. Um. We, the people said sailing. Uh. Oh. I think, come on. Can be a or something? Mounting, <laughs> um, from WoW. Um, yeah. That's that's good, mounting. You know, ride a dragon. That would be kind of epic. Actually, I think <laughs> that would be epic. Or ride a... I like dragons. Dragons are cool. Um, I like oh. killing them sometimes. Um, sometimes. I get... Yeah, they're... They're hard. They get they're easy and hard depending on what kind of dragon you're killing. So it works. Um, yeah. What is your favorite? Um, I'm going somewhere with this, by the way. Uh, what is your favorite aspects of RuneScape when you were playing uh, um, the game? I just um, competing with your friends and you know just. Having people around you, you know, and I don't know, just meeting new people and making friends. So people that I've been playing with um, for a long time, I, you know, we are planning to meet up and everything. And, yeah, like we're very good friends and, yeah, like, sh- yeah, that's what I liked about RuneScape. So, yeah. All right. Well, we're gonna get a little further in this. If you could be a JMod and work at Jagex, <laughs> uh, what department would you want to work in? Um, graphics, concept art, artist. Mhm. Yeah. Yeah. 
I, I figured you would go somewhere on those lines because of your drawing capabilities. Have you thought yeah. about um, um, applying to work for them? Because you're amazing at what you do. So I am not really because I'm not there yet. I still need more um, need more to improve. To be honest, um, they already. Like, if you compare their artists to me, um, this is like way better. <laughs> like, cause um, I still need like I don't know, learn a lot of shit to be honest. <laughs> so yeah, you'll get there one day. Yeah, I will. I yeah. think you're there now. So the things that you yeah. do, like this, especially with this new video, because I watched how you drew um, uh, one of the characters can't think of the character's name at the moment because I don't have it up, but... Um, Sorry, Dream. I think that's what it was. He was wearing Dahorix, so... Ah! Oh. Um, was that, that... Oh, yeah, yeah, I know which one you're talking about. The bone saw, um... Yeah. The concept art for my, um, animation video I did recently. Yeah. I watched that one, and he, he turned out to be extremely amazing. Um, Thank you. You're really... But that, <laughs> but that was a concept for a cartoon, not a for, you know... Maybe you can try, like, when you're not having videos, like, possibly even um, trying to create, like, a new character in RuneScape and yeah. passing it on to them. And then, like, even though you don't work for them, you can still have your your work put into the actual game. Yeah, I have actually um, thought about that, too. I have, um, back, I don't know, a couple of years ago, they had a competition for Players Gallery. And you had to design your own armor thing. Mm -hmm. So I kind of came up with one. But back then I had a message telling me that um, my armor was um, just too fancy and detailed to be in RuneScape. Oh, <laughs> and well, you might want to try again. Um, they got more fancy and more detailed now. Yeah, if they, have a, if they have the same competition again, yeah, I will go for it. Go for it again. So... I wish they would um, give us more it, outfits. It was called the um, a mighty mighty growler so or something so Damon. I can't remember, but it was like a mixture of growler, you know, um, the minions from the so um, from Commander Ziliana boss. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was kind of like a armor, you know, from growler. Oh, but, you'll yeah. have to show me that one day. Yeah, I will. That's that's hot. It looks like a lion, and like the um, plate body looks like a, you know, it's, it looks like what do you call it? Like a dragon plate body. Mhm. Mm yeah. In the style of like a lion. Yeah. Yeah. That would be. Really and cool. um, the helmet is like a lion, so yeah. It had like for the female, it had feathers, and for the guy, it had like um, lion hair and stuff. So yeah. Wow. I wish they would have implemented that. That would have been cool. <laughs> yeah, same here. I was like, please let me win. I like this song. <laughs> I love lines. <laughs> I wonder who won. Like, and if it got implemented. Uh, hmm. I, I don't know. It was one of them. Yeah. Um, I can't remember. Questions that I have and I'm getting stuck. Um, do you have any children? <laughs> yeah, I've got two dogs. <laughs> I bet they are a handful sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go ahead and ask. I don't know if you know who these artists are, but um, call me. It's a song called "Call Me Maybe." Um, it's by uh, Carly Rae Jepsen. Hey, um, call me maybe. Is it that one? Yeah, it's uh, I but just I've met you and, she... and I, or Titanium. Have you heard of that one by David no. Guetta and featuring Sia? Um, well, we have this like battle in. Like, it's, it's Titanium versus Call Me Maybe on the site, uh, on the radio. And, like, there's this big battle on what's going to be the RuneScape yeah. song. So, if you could pick between the two, even though you haven't heard um, Titanium. Uh, uh, I'm going to go with, hey, I just met you, la 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 la. I don't know what that song is, but, yeah, I'm going to go with that one because it's kind of, I don't know, it's catchy. Yeah. I like it. It's okay. I'm I'm a Titanium fan um, okay. myself. It's it's cool. You can be different. I haven't I have heard that, so I'll hear it. Let me see. Yeah. Are you googling or YouTubing it now? No, but 
because of the leg, but, um... Oh, yeah, that's... Yeah, let's not I'll get shit in it. Yeah, yeah, you live in Australia, so... Welcome to Australia. Um, so, you live in Melbourne, or, correct? Yep, Melbourne. Oh, yeah, that, I said Melbourne. Let's call it Melbourne. <laughs> Melbourne, Melbourne, yeah. I should have known. I have a lot of friends that live there, actually. Surprisingly enough, I have quite a few friends that live in Melbourne. Uh... And Australia, so it's cool. Um, do you like it there? Uh, yeah, it's all right. Um, the weather's kind of shitty because um, these couple of years is just the weather's <laughs> like a it's like a bitch that doesn't you know <laughs> can't make up her mind what to wear. You know, it's just one day it's raining, the next day it's sunny, the next day it's bloody you know cold again, and it's just yeah, Melbourne weather is just messed up <laughs> but yeah i don't mind melbourne it's all right it's a fun place i want to go to, start... to kangaroo i think it's called kangaroo island kangaroo yeah <laughs> it just it looks it's... you can ride a kangaroo if you want yeah that would be cool kangaroo? i'd rather swim with dolphins i'm like a dolphin fanatic uh, dolphins uh, like... so yeah um if you ever draw me you can draw my character swimming with dolphins, and that would be yeah. pretty epic. I uh, I know you're gonna get a lot of requests now for like everybody. Like uh, I have, I gave you I, my request, and I don't know how far along you are on that. Um, yeah, I still gotta um do that picture you told me to do. Yeah, we'll get. Uh, I I have to get a picture of of his. Oh, did I send? You yeah, did. I did. You did. Yeah. I sent you what I wanted. So I still have to finish that one off too. Have you even started? A little bit. <laughs> a little bit. It's easy. <laughs> like it's eh. just Toonie style, so that's what you wanted. Yeah, yeah I wanted Toonie style. Um, yeah. So if anybody's wondering, I have asked her to draw Nathan and Illustrial uh, holding the Rune Zone banner um, in a cartoon <laughs> style. So um, it won't be as epic as DJ Riddle's uh, amazing drawings that he does. Um but I think it's going to be extremely amazing. <laughs> it won't be stick figures. <laughs> but I'm sure uh, everybody will love it when it gets done. She should be working on it soon and having it done. Um, yeah, I'll be having it, it, it But it's going to be their like IRL picture. Um, it's their IRL picture <laughs> holding the banner. So it's not going to be their RuneScape picture um, holding a banner. But it's, instead it's going to be them cartooned. So hopefully... Um, I will be able to amaze you guys with that. So, um, I have I asked her that like oh, I don't know a week ago. So it takes a while to do. So I understand. Um, it's just because I've got a lot of requests, like friends have been asking me to do. So I'll get there. Trust me, I'll, I'll get it. There. I'll get it completed. Yeah, and then I could surprise them with it. Even though now they know it'll be that. Yeah, <laughs> like it's not a surprise, but. Yeah, it won't be exactly yeah. a surprise, but it'll be a surprise when they see it. Yeah. The fact that they don't know exactly what it's going to look like. Um, yeah. So if um, <clears throat> anybody wants to contact uh, Rita, a.k.a. Runetune, um, she does have a Twitter, she has a Facebook, um, and I think it's all listed on her YouTube page. Uh, yeah. So... I will link her YouTube page, her Twitter, and her Facebook page um, in the description below. And I, I really don't have anything else. To t um, you could tell us a little bit more about yourself if you want to. Stop I think I told you everything about me. <laughs> well, hey, how old are you? Uh, turned 23 last, last, wait, this month, yeah. Wait, happy birthday? Yeah, thank you. It was like to you. <laughs> May the third, yeah. Oh, happy late birthday to you. <laughs> um, thank you. Would you be interested in like, because we do a lot of um, series on Rune with Rune Zone, and um, would you be interested in making like a? It's going to be the time zone thing again, but I guess I could still ask. I'm interested in making, like, a guest appearance in mm -hmm. one of our video series, even though we probably will do it at, like, oh, 4, 5, or 6 a.m. your time, um, 24 <laughs> hours ahead of time. Um, if we could arrange you being in one of the videos, 
Um, would you be interested? Like, what, for radio? Or what is it like? Um, um, just a or? Well, we have a few episodes going down right now. Um, it's uh, We have this episode called the DIY Dragon Set, basically do-it-yourself Dragon Set. And, um, we have to go around and get, we're going to end up getting, um, full dragon, everything in the game that's dragon, except minus, like, the darts and stuff. Um, but we have to go around and get it ourselves without, um, (laughs) purchasing it from the Grand Exchange. Okay. Um, so... Uh, getting full dragon from scratch or something. Like that. Yeah, you wouldn't actually be participating in that, but you could be on the call. You know what I mean? Um, when okay. We, we, when we do it, so um, I can let you know, or it'll be a future thing. Uh, I have one more question for you. Since you told me you listened to the Rune Radio, mm-hmm. who are your top three DJs that you know of? Uh, you. <laughs> Um, you actually heard me, like DJ. Yeah, I've heard oh. you before. And who else? Um, I don't actually know their names, but was it what's his name, Jack or something? Jack L. He's he's not with us currently, but um, he was uh, he was an amazing uh dance. He did dance and techno. Yeah, yeah. I love um. Well, techno is my favorite thing, so yeah. I love dance and techno, so yeah. Well, when you're listening, you'll have to let me know. So I <laughs> actually I play a lot of it now because we did. He's no longer with us, so I kind of took on uh, okay. playing more dance and techno because a lot of our listeners actually like it. Um, yeah. So I try to I try to please everybody, but I I just can't do it. You know, you should play more of um Cosmic Gate. Have you ever heard of them? Who? Cosmic Gates. Cosmic Gate. Gate. Oh, I'll, I'll tell you about it later. <laughs> I'll link, or like, link you their channel and stuff. Yeah, I... They got, they got some great music, you know. Mm. Oh, yeah. I will definitely like... look into getting some of that for you. Yeah. Um. Thank you. You're <laughs> welcome. Hey, you have any other ideas for me? So I can uh, get some more music that you'll like? Like techno and, um, trance or... Anything. Anything? Yeah. Yeah, there's shitloads on it, um... Uh, where do I start? I can name them um, like to you on um, Skype if you want. Like, yeah, I've got you'll have to send me a Skype. list so I can get some more of that music. Cause, um, honestly, cause Jack was our our pro status at um, uh, doing all that stuff, but um, and he, I don't have any of his music. I had like a couple of his songs, but other than yeah. that, no, I didn't have any. But I will definitely look into expanding my my library for you and and obviously all the other listeners listening but um i yeah, yeah i was looking at getting new um new ideas yeah I'll definitely um look into it and i'll send you um a couple of names you know on skype and for the best ones i know but yeah yeah um Uh. Oh, you were back then. Are you still in touch with some of the old uh, generation YouTubers? Uh, uh, Regicidal? <laughs> That's where I got one of the questions from. That's funny. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't get to ask him that. <laughs> That's cool. I'm really uh, I'm I think that close with him. Right now, so. Was for him, yeah. <laughs> He was one of the old ones. As long, I mean, I, I mean, you have Excel, uh, you have Tanub Show. Well, I was back. I was around there back then, but I wasn't known. So, um, I um, used to know all these. Like, I used to follow Shosh, the Fat Wrecked, um, Vodka, um, I think it was Vodka Five, uh, the Unforgiving, Regicidal, of course, um. Who else? So my tenuous shape, of course. Um, yeah. So I was just a, you know, a newbie YouTuber. So, but yeah, I kind of, you know, sometimes they kind of inspired me. 
mm-hmm. to actually make videos. But the most people that actually um, inspired me um, to make uh, animation videos are, what do you call them? Uh, I don't know if you guys know them, but they're like kind of popular animators on YouTube are Harry Patrick and um, Chris O'Neill and... Who else was Igoraptor? If you guys know Igoraptor, so yeah. No, but I'm sure we might look into it now. And he's the guy that um known for the Pokemon awesome thing, the animation Pokemon you made. So I'm sure some people will know <laughs> who Igoraptor mm. is. He's possibly. He's, yeah, he's well known. So yeah, he's the one who inspired me to the most. I've been watching them for a while, so yeah. What is your favorite food and why? <laughs> food, um, food, hang on. I like lollies. I love candy. <laughs> candy is my favorite thing. Candy? Oh, yeah. And it's I like lollies. how you said them lollies because they're suckers here. <laughs> lollies. lollies. I knew that only because I talked to a bunch of Australians, so it's amazing yeah. how. That's like, why I straight away said candy because you know. <laughs> yeah, I love lollies. It's What's good your shit. favorite lolly or favorite flavor? I love Zappos. If any. I don't know what they are personally. But yeah, I'll, they're like if you eat so many of them, you get all hyper and high. So it's kind of funny. So I love them. Is that, so sweet, is that what keeps you going to make your videos? Kinda. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I love grape and raspberry and strawberry. Yeah. What's your favorite fruit? What's <laughs> uh, um, my favorite fruit? I don't know. I don't have to eat fruit. Hang on. I do eat fruit, but... Apple... Yay, apples are good. Uh, watermelon's my favorite because I'm allergic to it. So I love anything flavored watermelon. I'm actually, uh, uh, I have good. a piece of candy in my mouth now, has, and it's watermelon flavored. So Good on hot weather is watermelon. I love them. I can't eat it. <laughs> <laughs> I did when I was a kid, but I can't anymore. Um, uh-huh. So I know you mentioned a, pe- a bunch of people um, that inspired you, but who was your biggest inspiration on making your um, videos or starting a YouTube channel and like going from there? I don't know, drawing probably I, uh, well drawing I, people that inspired me were um, the Disney movies have you ever watched Disney movies? Love Disney uh, that's right Disney, oh Every time I make animation videos, I always try to aim for Disney, you know? I, that's what keeps me improving with my work, with, with my drawings. I always try and aim for Disney, so that's, you know, some advice for... You should do, like, a RuneScape people. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Maybe <laughs> one day. But, yeah, um, Dragon Ball Z, Looney Tunes, all this stuff that inspired me to draw as a little kid. And then, um, for YouTube, it's just, you know, uh, all these animators on YouTube I was watching, and Tanoop Show, I was watching Tanoop Show, how much, you know, how much views he needs to get for his videos, for just being funny, and, um, yeah, it's just watching other people, you know, succeed and stuff, and just... You know, I love what they do, you know, and I was like, I can do that, you know. If they can do that, I can do that too. So that's what I did. That's amazing. I should have made you draw something while we were doing this. <laughs> seen what you can come up with during the time that we were doing this. Yeah, it was. It would be very hard to actually talk and draw, but... <laughs> <laughs> I noticed you, you totally have this, like, you like seeing when I you draw. I like, cons- concentrate, like, be focused, you know? Mm-hmm. But, yeah. Excuse me. We could have done it. Yeah, we um, could have still. <laughs> so, if there was one thing you could do to tell people to inspire them to, like, I don't know, go the distance, what would you tell them? 
just be yourself. Be yourself and just, you know, aim what you want to, like, what do you say? What, how do you say this? Just, you know, dreams do come true sometimes. So, yeah, I've never thought that I would get that many followers, that many fans and, you know, just dreams do happen. So, you know, be always positive. So, yeah. And just be yourself, so <laughs> that's all I can say. That's all I do. They don't like me, I can't help what? it. Haters are gonna hate though. <laughs> well, I have haters too. I mean, what can I say? No, you don't like, you like me. have haters, you're amazing. <laughs> uh, I do, but <laughs> it's just you know, everyone will have haters no matter what. So don't let them get into your way, just look at them and that's all. Mm-hmm. I always ignore them. I don't I don't give a shit. I mean if, if I could swear, I would swear at him, but I can't swear at him, so... Mm-hmm. <laughs> it just is, you know... It just causes mm-hmm. more hating, actually, if yeah. you fight with them. So if you love them, there's not much they can do except either yeah, go yeah. away or... She's just um, there to piss you off, right? It's just, you know, trying to get on, on your nerves. But for me, it doesn't work because, for me, I'm a troll too, so <laughs> good luck on that. Can't you wanna troll, troll a troll. Video? Yeah. <laughs> You can't troll a troll, so... Sorry. I'm just making sure that I asked all the questions from the forum. And... Looks like I have... Um... Yeah. So, um, it's been a fun interview. Yay! Yeah. We didn't actually... I don't, I don't think I'll have to, like, cut too much of it out, so... Um, Except at the beginning, when we were figuring out whether I was recording or not. That was fun. Um, <laughs> but I have been DJ Queen Anita, and I have interviewed Runetune, a.k.a. Rita. And it was an amazing time. Thank you. Um, it will be up on the um, Rune Zone. Um, God, I can't even think. Uh, Rune Zone YouTube at Rune Zone <laughs> Videos, uh, which you're listening to it now. So that <laughs> makes a whole lot of sense. <laughs> But do be sure to show her just as much love as she shows the entire community by making her videos um, and going to subscribe to her and liking her videos and letting her know how you think in a positive way um, and how she could be more creative Um, because I'm sure your ideas one day could become an actual animation and she can let you know that she did it and uh, I'm sure she'll love the ideas. It helps her. Obviously it'll help her because then she doesn't have to think. She can go and use your guys' ideas, so... I have actually... Yeah, I've actually, um... I always listen to my subscribers, so... You guys, um... I always read your comments, so... You know, don't be afraid to... Be like, oh, you know... What if I post and she doesn't read my comment? You know, don't be afraid. I always... Every comment, I I read. You know, but sometimes I can't reply to all of you, but... I only reply to the ones that I need, so... You guys, you can, you know... I always, you know, take your ideas and, you know, what she, what DJ, Mrs. DJ Anita said here, I might one day use them as, you know, my video. So, yeah. And if you do send her a private message, I will say that she is really good at getting back to you in a timely manner because she got back to me quite quickly. Um, so... Um, and if it's or obviously a replyable message, she would reply to you, um, or she'll still reply to you and let you know that you know she can't do it or it's not applicable or whatever. But she is really good about getting back to her PMs on YouTube. Yeah. So and she does have a Facebook tr- yeah. and <laughs> what, Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube, so you can always contact her about anything. Um, yeah. She loves you guys. So. Thanks for the interview. Um, we may do a follow-up interview depending on the feedback that we get. Um, so if we do do another follow-up interview to answer more questions that the users may have for you, uh, would you be willing to do that? Yeah, sure. Of course. Yay. So thanks for listening, and you guys have a fantastic day. No worries. And See you later. Oh, do I say bye? Yeah. Okay. See you later, loonies. Bye. <laughs> that was cute. All right. <laughs> DJ Anita and Rita's out. Bye.